All right, it's finally time for Yu-Gi-Oh, everyone. If, uh, if I can just be in the game and actually do things, yes. So I don't know why it, it for some reason it wasn't capturing. That was very weird because it worked fine just a second ago before I went live, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, chat. So this is Yu-Gi-Oh! The False Bound Kingdom. Um, story, data for this game already exists. Okay, yeah. That's just for when I was testing this to make sure it saved. So I'll overwrite that. It's not a big deal. So this game has two stories you can start with, Yu-Gi-Oh! or Kaiba's. I'm going to start with Yu-Gi's. Supposedly, um... The, se the second story you do after you beat the first one gets harder. So, whatever. I'm told Yugi's meant to be a tutorial anyway. Let's do it. War campaign. I had this game when I was really young, but I never uh, was able to beat... Those who claim to control the gods are in fact controlled by the gods. Alexander Irvine... Philosopher. Wow, we're really starting a Yu-Gi-Oh game with a philosophical quote. I don't remember that. Anyways, well, this must be the lab mentioned in the letter you got. SIC Domino Labs. Yep, this looks like the place. And Yugi is looking like very bootleg. That I did notice when I was testing this. It's pretty far from the city. There's nothing else here. Doesn't this building look futuristic? SIC is a famous overseas game company, isn't it? It's a new game company that just started here in Japan, but it's already becoming a major player. Although it's relatively new, it's gotten pretty big by releasing a bunch of innovative games. They've been using 3D images and virtual reality research to create some amazingly lifelike environments. Sounds a lot like what Kaiba's company does. According to this invitation, they're doing exactly the same kind of work as Kaiba Corporation. SIC has incorporated cutting-edge technologies to develop next-generation virtual reality technology. SIC hopes to work in the field of games to perfect this technology using the widely popular Duel Monsters. SIC plans to further develop the technology through gameplay. Their technological goals may be scientific, but if they're using Duel Monsters, I want to get a look at it. Me too! This is so exciting! Why did they send invitations to us, though? I think they sent invitations to everyone that ranked well at the Duelist Kingdom and Battle City tournaments. In order to test a new duel simulator, Kingdom, SIC is sponsoring a test trial. And respectively, er, and respectfully ask for your assistance in helping us make Kingdom the best game it can be. It also says to bring friends if you want. Naturally, I thought of you guys right away. Just so, just so we're all clear, I'm here because I did so well in the tournaments. Oh yeah? Then where's your invitation? Tristan's also looking... All the characters are looking a little crusty. I know this was GameCube. Like, early GameCube, but come on. They could have done better than that. I don't remember it looking this bad. Let's see, they must have sent it to the wrong address. Yeah, sure. At least we know that Yugi is here as a finalist. That's right. Come on, Tristan. I'll take you. Right here and now. Stop it, both of you. This is no time to fight. Look, there's someone from the lab waiting for us. Let's get going. So yeah, I could never beat this game when I was young, and that's pretty much the goal right now. You must be Yugi Moto. Yugi Moto, we've been waiting for you. Uh-huh, that's me, and these are my friends. Wonderful, let's all go inside, shall we? Oh boy. And... Hey Yugi, didn't we see this guy at Kaiba Corporation once? I think so, but all but all of the people of Kaiba Corporation give off the same kind of weird vibe. You are correct. I did work for Kaiba Corporation. Jeez, he hurt us. We're almost at the main lab. I like how that guy has better looking art than the main characters. It's funny. What in the world is... This is SIC's latest simulator. Codename Kingdom. This is just a prototype. We're only using the dual disc for packaging reasons. It's all original SIC hardware in the inside. Is this what you use to recreate the world of Duel Monsters? Yes, our tests of Kingdom have been very successful so far. We've constructed an entire fantasy world based on Duel Monsters. 
We'd like you to help us test the simulator by simply playing the game as you normally would. The simulator supports multiple players, so you will all be able to play at the same time. It's a, in multiplayer mode, everyone joins the game as a different game character. It sounds like a network game or something. These new games are so awesome. Kingdom is a fantasy world. The card monsters there are alive. You will all join the resistance and fight against the Empire, which is suppressing the general population. Of course, you'll all participate in the game as different characters. The game is currently set for a few hours and we'll be recording your play data from here. Cool. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's play. Yeah. All right. This is so exciting. I wonder what it'll be like. Yugi, does this seem on the level to you? Hmm? What do you mean? This whole simulator seems suspicious. You're probably just overreacting. Ah, it's about to start. After 300 years of ruling the the Rondeville continent, the... Oh, boy. It's, how do you say that? Saigivarthus Varth's empire is faced with a crisis. Since the 12th emperor, Heishin, ascended to the throne, corruption and brutality have spread through the empire. People suffer oppression, but their complaints have fallen on deaf ears. Heishin and a select group of his underlings have been living in the lap of luxury. Their lavish lifestyle is supported by heavy taxation, which has pushed most of the populace to the brink. People on the fringes of the Empire have responded with rebellion and revolt. This uprising has extended as far as the northern part of the Empire, on the Vaxi Islands. What's the matter? I don't know, but I've got a really bad feeling about this. Kingdom Simulator Overload. Safety lock engaged. Beginning transition to mode 2. This doesn't seem good. Transition, transition to mode 2 complete. Kingdom simulator lock-in mode activated. Well, what's happening? Ah! That's not good. Yi. Yugi. Happened, Lord Yugi. Lord Yugi, wake up, please, Lord Yugi. Oh, my, my head. You seem to be coming out of it. Where am I? Huh? You're in the port city of, uh, Makad, on the western edge of Voxy Island. Voxy, Voxy? I don't know how to say it. You lost conscious cautiousness already. You just passed out, right in the middle of our meeting. Don't you remember? Remember what? You appear to be suffering from memory loss. Let me explain everything as quickly as I can. Your name is Yugi. You are the leader of the resistance here in Makad. We were planning our next attack when you passed out. We've tricked the Imperial forces into splitting up. And e Edos, Edos, the ruler of these lands, is left with few guards. It was the perfect chance for us to break the Emperor's repressive hold, and we're about ready to attack. Is any of this coming back to you? Anything at all? None. None of it. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. But it sounds like I'm expected to take command of the Resistance. That is correct, Lord Yugi. You are, after all, Supreme Commander of the Resistance. Without you, we don't even have enough Marshals. You must lead on the front lines. Marshal? Oh dear, have you forgotten everything? Marshals are a type of general and are central to a battle. Marshals can control monsters and engage in battle by pitting their monsters against those of the enemy. Each monster has incredible power, Power equal to that of several thousand human soldiers. This is why the marshals hold the key to victory in any battle. However, the number of men with this power over monsters is small. Including you, the resistance has but three. So you're telling me that I have this special martial ability? You have it in spades, sir. Although, I'm afraid that your powers might be weaker in your current state. You will just have to get it back slowly in battle. In the beginning, I will assist your recovery, Lord Yugi. Remember that Imperial units usually have a marshal assigned to them as well. You will need to get your battle instincts back if you're going to defeat the Imperial Marshals. For the time being, we need to finish planning our strategy and organize our units. Come this way. Well, this is a fine mess we're in. I know, it doesn't feel like we have any control over the game. I think it's safe to assume that we're trapped in this fantasy game world. 
They must have been planning on using us as their lab rats from the beginning. I wonder if the rest of our friends are here too. It's likely, though they're probably just all confused by whatever character roles they've been thrown into as well. We've got to find a way out of here. I don't know how much of the how much of what the SIC techies told us is true, but they did say that this is a game. Uh-huh. Then it's got to have an ending, right? Maybe if we play the game and clear all the levels, it'll lead to a way out. That makes sense. With the help from the rest of our friends, I'm sure we'll find a way way home. That seems to be our best bet for now. Please look carefully at the map of Rondeval. This is Makad, where we are right now. All right, and this is the target of our next battle. We're going to liberate the re the the rest of Voxai Voxai Island. Va I don't know. Is there? I, there's no way anyone could get mad at me for not knowing how to pronounce all these weird made-up places. In order to do that, we've got to take control of Sugut. The provincial capital to the east. Sure. I see. Sugat is a is a large castle in the northern section. It's well defended and heart and houses a large fighting force. We won't stand a chance if we attack head on. First we've got to get them to divide up their force. We should be able to lure some units away from the capital by liberating nearby lands. Places like Edos Makad. But we've already managed to thin out the defenses at Makad. Let's attack in force and take our victory first. Or take our first victory. Okay, what should I do? You will direct your marshals on the field of battle and attack the enemy main base, Lord Yugi. I'm certainly not as strong as you, but I will also command a team of monsters and assist you. Just remember that n Remember that none of your other mark- Remember that none of your- Do you mean that? I think that's a misspelling right there. Or the wrong word. Just remember that none of your other marshals are nearly as powerful as you are. We depend heavily on you. Your success on the battlefield is the key to the success of the resistance. There are many other details to plan. Let's start with organizing our units ahead for the difficult battle. What do you mean by organizing? As you may remember, I mentioned a little while ago that the enemy army has its own marshals. Only a marshal commanding his own monsters stands any chance against an enemy marshal. No matter how weak a marshal may be, he can command up to three monsters. We're fighting an enormous empire. The number and power of its monster units are just as frightening, frighteningly enormous. We must organize our own monsters into units so that we can combat the enemy. Luckily for us, we have several monsters that are willing to fight for our cause. The first thing you need to do is organize the monsters into groups, then assign them to your marshals. Each group of monsters is called a team. Please try to remember that, Lord Yuki. Let's start assembling our teams, shall we? After the teams are assembled, it's time to send them to battle. When you are ready, let me know. Also pay special attention to the center monster. This monster is the team leader, and the team's movement speed is determined by the speed of its leader. I understand. I'll start by assembling my teams. Alright. Okay. Fizdis. Fizdis. Okay, friend. Uh, hang on a second. Okay, that's how I make you go. Horn. Okay. Alright. Ability, Knight Adept. Oh, do they have abilities? Let's see. Battle Arts, Multiple Spine Shoot, Shadow Claw, Knight Adept. Can I, like, check those abilities? I'm a, I, I can probably figure out... Hmm. Probably figure out what Knight Adept means, but still. Discount, Master of the Egyptian Goods... All right, we're back. I had to just take a second and run upstairs because there was noise going on. It doesn't matter. Oh, no, that's the wrong button. Hang on, let's go back. Anyways, I'm pretty sure I got the, the team menu figured out. It's a little weird, but it's not a big deal. Boop.
Boop, boop. No, someone just decided to shuffle around the uh, recyclable holes in the living room floor. <laughs> and it was getting real loud that I had to go up there and be like, Hey, what are you doing? The Resistance is about to engage in its first battle. Let us take the victory this day. As you can see, there are four villages, including the enemy main base at Makad and the base at Jakud. Thanks to our earlier planning, the main enemy force is much smaller than it once was and is not massed nearby. The, the ruler, Edos, has no idea we're ready to attack. Let's take this chance to secure our position in the area. First, send someone to free the village of Rutham. It's not far from Jakud. Jakud. The village is filled with supporters of the resistance. It will be a good foothold from where we can attack. As we free the nearby villages from repressive imperial rule, they will offer us items and money. We both need these things to help build up our force, so we must try to free as many places as possible. Currently, all of our teams are holding position at Jakud. Let's select teams and send into battle from there and send them to the village of Rutham. Send a team into battle, position the cursor over a town, team press the A button, the select command for the team carry out. Finally move the cursor to the location you want the team to go and press the A button, this dispatches the team. Okay, time to go to battle. Yugi's forces, free Makad, wiped out, falls to the enemy, okay. So let's start by moving you up here. Then we'll go ahead and uh, put you here. Then I guess, do I want Yugi to go here? Lie in wait. All right, they all leave after I press B. That's how it works. All right, I recall this game. Again, so I could never beat this game when I was young. I've always wanted to come back to it. I figured now it's finally time to do just that. Let's see. Grrr. Is this an ambush? Grrr. Let's see. All right. I, this must be one of the recruitable monsters. I tried to find a guide for that stuff, but um, couldn't. There we go, yeah, just attack. I couldn't find, like, a well-organized guide, so I just said, ah, I'll, I'll ask people if there's a monster I can get on each mission. I'm assuming this is the monster I can get here. It's good old Silver Fang, one of Yugi's monsters. Wild Sonic Storm. Now that's an attack. Hang on. How do I... Okay, that's how that does... The D-pad changes the camera. All right. Attack. Attack with the needles, Karibo. Destroy everything. All I can really do is mash A in this situation, though. Wild Sonic Storm. Karibo is cuter than Moomin? No, it's not. Karibo's a little monster underneath all of that hairballs. Let's see. Critical. Win. Okay. I used up all the action points, so it just the scuffle ends. Silverfang has joined your army. Okay, I'll take it. Why not? Okay, it's only the first mission. This shouldn't be too difficult. Probably replace that weak Karibo. Rutham has liberated 500 Gs. We've successfully freed Rutham. We now have two footholds in the area. We now have better, we're in better shape than the enemy now. But news of our attack has probably reached the main base at Makad. But I've just gotten word from spies that there's a troop movement at Makad. They will be headed here shortly. We can either build up our defenses and prepare for the attack, or try to free another village. What would you like to do? It is much easier to meet an enemy from a village or, or castle than in the open fields. I wonder, does, um... 
Wh where's Yugi? Eden was liberated. Oh, he's on his way. Officer. Where where's Yugi? I'll send him to the forest, right? Uh hang on. You're there. So why don't I see you? Oh, you're oh, I can barely see you at all. Go here. Uh, what can I do? Command. Can't really do anything here, can I? Hmm. So, one thing I do know about this game is that apparently you can enter the Konami code at, like, almost any any time and just get free money, and it's you can do it over and over. Uh, I'm not going to do that, because that's a little easy. All right. And now we got everyone's favorite character. Fizdis. Hang on a second. I don't know who this character is. Let's see. Maybe go take out the weakest for now, I guess. Horn Imp. Let's see. What is this weird monster crab thing I've got? Bubbles. Oh, you're weak. Let's see. Cocoon string. So it looks like a skirmish ends whenever um, I run out of... Um, everyone uses up their action points, I guess. Man, I remember... I somehow still remember all the music in this game. It's really good. Let's see. Finish it, Bubbles. Let's see. Hammer. Okay, he's out of points. Um, I guess I'll now just focus on this here. Oh, he guarded? Fine. Is there any recovery after battles? I'll have to learn things. Yeah, it does seem like the combat's slow. I'm pretty sure this game got, like, it did not get very good reviews when it when it came out. But it's Yu-Gi-Oh, so I'm nostalgic for it. And a lot of people have gone, uh... A lot of people have gone wild uh, just at the thought of me playing this game, so I figured it'd be fun, fun to finally get back to it. I've always wanted to play... I've always wanted to play this game again. Lose. All right, so... Oh, right, the score thing appears when you hold start. Whoever, it, it's the total damage that's done. A winner is determined by that. Okay, you're knocked out. And then... Did he get HP back? Let's see. Did you win? I did. It sent him back. The idea is that I'm supposed to use other forces to also intercept like that. But I wasn't able to. Let's see. No problem. Well, to be fair, a lot of old Yu-Gi-Oh games got really bad reviews because the people that played them didn't like Yu-Gi-Oh. And shockingly, many of these games are made specifically for people who like Yu-Gi-Oh. I know, it's very hard to imagine how a strategy RPG with Yu-Gi-Oh monsters and characters was only aimed at people who like Yu-Gi-Oh, but hey, what do I know? I'm not a game designer. Is there a weakness system? I don't even think there's an element system. We are at, like, uh... This is this is true caveman Yu-Gi-Oh, like the Duel Monsters era. You attack with the bigger monster, over and, and you just keep hitting each other. And somebody wins eventually. Or you, su or you just summon Summon Skull. Fiends beat dreams. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
I gotta pay attention to which ones use guard, because I don't think they have an animation. It just says the word guard. Club scissors. This is Ancient Egypt Yu-Gi-Oh. Ah, oh, yes, my favorite ancient e Egyptian monsters. The this big lobster. Is that Raoul from Animal Crossing? If you want it to be, it can be. Spinning sword slash. I'm the one with the penguin. Or rather, I'm the one that the team that's winning. Yeah, the, the stuff on the bottom. I like how you can adjust the camera. It's pretty cool. Oops. Oh, I missed. There we go. Yeah, I won. Leveling up is nice. Uh, let's see. Oh, I okay. Don't even give me a chance to look at that, why don't you? But yeah, I've I've been really looking forward to playing this game today. Just cuz Oh, yeah, he's not going to get there in time. Fizdis is going to have to do it again. This was on GameCube, and I think there was a PS2 version. Just keep finishing it off. But yeah, uh... Editing... I'm close to finishing editing, but things didn't go so well with the software the other day, so I really just wanted to take today. I was going to wait until my video was done editing and uploaded before I started this, but I figured, who cares? Let's just play it. Let's take a day off and just relax. It was GameCube exclusive. I could have sworn that this was also on PS2. Fizdis leveled up. Who is Fizdis? Uh, hang on a second. There was also there, there was one on PS2 called like Duelist of the Roses. All right, just a random person. All right, so the enemy if the enemy takes this place, that's it. But hang on, what's this? Subjugated cooperation. Looks like my next goal is gonna be Yeah, it's just him. This is the main castle from Akkad. Its ruler, Governor Eidos, is infamous for his cruelty and greed. Uh there's big sections up here. Okay, yeah, the map. The map literally is just a square. Let's see. So again, there's like we saw with Silverfang, there's these random monster encounters that happen, but um Hang on. Why don't we send you? And I'm able to recruit monsters in certain missions, sort of like in Fire Emblem, how you can, like, you have limited opportunities to recruit certain characters. I couldn't find a good, like, list to have on hand, but it, I'll, a I'll ask at, like, the start of a mission if there's something I can get or possibly miss. Let's see. Tutorial map is tutorial map. Yes, it is. It's pretty basic. One one Goomba and one Koopa to take out. That's pretty much what this is. Where is the other guy? Oh, he's right there. Is there like a... Okay, I can increase the circle. Is there a fast cursor option? I can zoom out. Man, it's weird how sometimes the B button doesn't work on some menus, so it causes a con confusion with me. It's time to attack the enemy's main base. You cannot defeat an enemy in its main base, town, or castle by simply fighting better than them. You must force the enemy to flee or defeat all of the enemy's monsters in there in order to win. It is difficult to defeat an enemy in their stronghold unless you surround them and attack in waves. Be careful not to chase your enemy too far. They might be leading you into a trap. Now let's tr go get the enemy. You insolent brat. Just who do you think you are? Guards, where are my guards? You're the only one left. Get ready for the end. 
Ah, traitors, how dare you revolt against the Empire. I'll take some of you with me before I'm done. All right, here we go. Do do. All right, he's got that dragon. All right, his weakest is. Hold up a sec. Uh, info. Flip. Okay, no items. I remember healing items can be a big pain in the butt. My levels are all one. Cemetery. Play. There we go. Wow, that did nothing. Every team just seems to have this one monster that's absolutely useless, and Shadow, Shadow Spectre appears to be mine. Purple Blade. Let's do it. Okay. Ooh, that, that dragon might be a bit of a problem. I hope it doesn't- this game doesn't have shenanigans where, like, I have to beat every single character with Yugi, otherwise I can't recruit anybody. Stuff like that'd be annoying. We can do it. Okay, um... I can finish the- the warrior there with, uh, Shadow Spectre. It only happens, like, once. Let's see. Am I aware of a Blue Eyes equivalent of Cyber Twin Dragon? I... Uh, no. Did they make that? I'm not sure. I don't know much about the Blue Eyes archetype. I've been make. I've actually been making, like, a Red Eyes deck to play with it against Andrew with lately. That's been fun. The other week when the power went out, we just spent, like, the whole day playing Yu-Gi-Oh! I've got, like, uh, a Red Eyes and a Brotherhood of the Fire Fist deck that I've been playing with. Let's see. I'm still trying. I'm hopefully, this weekend, I wanted to go down to my local card shop again. I also wanted to get take Andrew so he could get some sleeves for his cards. My God, goodness, the sleeves make everything much better. Oh, hi, Andrew. I didn't realize you were there. Yes, I am tired of your Sacred Beast deck. All right, and immediately we attack again. Red Eyes are some of the most expensive non-good decks ever. Well, I'm having fun with it. I've just been making a Red Eyes deck from like the that weird like legacy thing that came out, like uh, the Pegasus and Joey box. There's some fun stuff in there. I, I just like trading cards are fun, but don't matter. Anyways, let's see. Um, let's not waste the strongest attack on the Mantis. Let's attack you. Oh, Alright. Soldier Spike. Destroy. Freebo attack! Oh, that didn't even finish it. That's sad. Well, I'm not worried about the damage I'm receiving from the enemy. Just save my strongest attacks for the dragon. Carolyn. This game has some really good music. I've had this music has been stuck in my head since I played this game way back in 2003. And I, I don't think I've ever really listened to the OST on YouTube and stuff. Wow! You... Alright, fine. Fine, I'll attack this. Karibo is garbage confirmed. <laughs> yeah, I definitely won that. Ah, uh, still no level up. Okay. Yeah, you didn't miss much. So far, I'm just do still doing the tutorial mission. And there was, like, a couple of minutes that I had to go upstairs and tell someone not to sort recycling right ab directly above me, because I could hear that. 
no recycling in this house. Except for the Yu-Gi-Oh! brand name. Alright, let's do it. Uh, maybe I should start guarding with Celtic Guardian. I don't want him to lose and not get experience. Just attack Feral Imp or something, man. Almost done. Oh, he's guarding. He's guarding. Well, let's just attack then. Zero. I mean, what am I gonna do? Very little. That's the answer. Um, I guess I'll just guard here. He's waiting. Oh, he just wants me to finish him off now. He gave up. Finish it. Nice. Let's see. Everyone got a little level up. That's good. That's good. I wish it, I wish it would wait for me to press A or something on the level up screen. Because I wanted to check the stats, but it automatically goes. Makad was liberated. A splendid first victory, Lord Yugi. Our actions here have stirred the people in these lands to fight back against the Empire. The noble families in the area are offering to assist us, uh, assist us financially. If we continue to win like this, the resistance should grow nicely. The Empire is confused right now, but it's only temporary. They'll soon send units to hunt us down. Let's take this opportunity to secure our positions and fight off the enemy. Now it's time for you to make an appearance, Lord Yugi. The people want to meet their savior. And ask what is up with his hair. Blackland Fire Dragon has joined your army. Nice! Gold, gold, monster reborn! Blue medicine, blue medicine. Nice. Fury of the Empire. Yugi's Resistance Army de decides to undertake its next mission before the Empire strikes back. Ah ha ha ha! With, um, Sugat confused about what to do, the Resistance plans to free a large agricultural village village to the south. Our success in freeing Makad area the Makad area has strengthened the determination of the resistance. Let's strike the stores of the Imperial forces while morale is high. We can cut them off from their supplies. The southern part of the island is mostly farmland. The Empire works most of the farmers like slaves. If we can free this area, all supplies to Sugit will be cut off and will gain a significant advantage. However, General S Sebekel, one of the fiercest generals in the regular Imperial Army, appears to be in the area. Sebekel is a dangerous foe, well known for his ferocity. I don't believe he has a large force with him, but we should still be careful not to make any mistakes. That reminds me, I believe we received some items from our last engagement. You can use these items by equipping the monsters with them. Just remember you can't change your mind once you send a monster into battle. When, pre when preparing for battle, think carefully about which item you give to which monster. Alright. So far, so good. I'm having fun. Uh, let's just make a save on the screen here. So we're on mission two. I keep forgetting what button I mapped to Z. Or, uh, where the Z button is on my get Nintendo GameCube controller, of course. Two, two, you didn't level up. So I have no choice but to use Yugi and, uh, Shimon. Fizdis can just not appear if, if they want. I don't know anything about this character, they're just really just here. Let's see... See, it's really- you want to know what's really weird about this menu? Is, I can't check my monster's abilities on this screen. But I can on this screen. Uh, oh wait, no. Now I can't. Wait, now I can't. What's going on? What, where's Forest Adept? I can't look at that anymore. Hang on. Do I have to... I wonder. Hang on a second. Now I can't check it at all. I don't understand this menu. Never mind. I don't know. I don't know, chat. No, I want to put items on. Let's see. 
Uh, how about we just seven blue medicine, drink this medicine, and restore a small amount of life points. Ah, yes. Restores a incapacitated team monster. Put this on you. And that on you, because everyone attacks Celtic Guardian instead. And, um... Oh, wait, I should change up the monsters. Hang on. Edit. Replace. Level 6. Oh, my. That's good. But do I want to use that? How about... Oh, no, it's number 6. My, my, my dumb mistake. What about Silver Fang? How about I give... Let's see, there's the stats, level 2. Much more attack power. Huh. Feral Imp, or Horn Imp there, got a lot. How about I replace... Hang on, actually, let's see you. Wow, Shadow Spectre is awful. How about we take off Shadow Spectre and give him the dragon, why not? Yeah, they're, I like how their level 1 stats are clearly just their stats on the trading card. You can never win without Karibo, can I? Which looks like there's a bit of monsters in this game to find. Karibo... I, can I compare stats? Oh man, Karibo is actually really, really bad. Look at that. This should be good enough. Um, I'll keep this for now. Hang on, what is... Yeah, Silver Fang's not bad. Let's just, uh, I'm sure the next one's not gonna be too hard. I'm doing pretty well. Now, nah, I'll save the item for now. It's just one extra thing, but let's just go. Oh boy. Oh man, this music's so great. It's awfully quiet. There doesn't appear to be any enemy movement. There's monsters in the forest I can get here. Okay, that's pretty much the only um advice I want to be able to get during this. Otherwise, I want to do it blind. I want to try and pick up as much um monsters as I can. We seem to be lucky. The enemy doesn't seem to know we're here. According to our scouts, the closest fort isn't guarded at all. Let's use this opportunity to take the fort and fortify a defensive position there. Yugi's forces free Ashuton. Go to the forest in the bottom left corner of the map for new monsters. Okay. Bottom left corner. Over here, okay. Time limit. Okay, watchtower for supervising farmers. It gets taken down each night. Okay. The camera's a little weird when you're in the corner. Um... Oh, I can buy equipment now. Anti-air cannon. It used to attack enemy te flying teams. Attack ground teams. Okay, cool, cool. Trader. Blue medicine. Goblin secret remi remedy. Monster Reborn. Uh, let's see. I think I'll send Yugi to deal with... Okay, camera. First, I'll send Yugi there, but I'm also gonna send this dude there. Uh, wait, what? He's not leaving? Oh, now he is, okay. And what about over here? Obviously, I need- I still need someone to guard this place, here. Fizdis will be fine, I suppose. Could, can I fortify the fort with the catapult turtle? Uh. This game is very relaxing so far, I like it. Although, I can definitely see the complaints of it feeling, like, really slow. What about this here? This is a slave detention center. Detainees long for the resistance to set them free. Well, we gotta do that. 
Why don't we? How many enemy units do I have to deal with here? Let's see, there's two here. Oh, that looks like a bigger boss. Watchtower, it's a telltale sign. We've successfully taken the fort from the enemy. A few guards that were here have run off. It won't be long before they learn of our attack and try to retake the fort. General Sebekel's unit is powerful. What, what do you think of building equipment to increase the fort's defensive defenses? What do you mean by equipment? Equipment are offensive and defensive additions that made to a castle or fort that provide an advantage in battle. For instance, you can install a large cannon to fire at approaching foes or construct a barricade. To install additions, position the curse over the castle or fort and select equipment. Then select an addition from the list, any button, blah blah blah. Of course, each piece equipment requires money. Be sure to plan. Ah, oh, there they come. Okay. Equipment. Oh, barricade, defensive wall, healer. Oh, there's a lot more now. Or maybe I just didn't see. I'm just gonna put this here. Let's just attack. And then let's... Team Command. I'm gonna have Yugi go over here. Because apparently there's something in this forest. Okay, so if I can make use of this stuff, maybe I can make the battles a little less slow. Okay, uh... You're in range, pal. No, I don't want to rebuild it. I want to use it. Did it not work? The cannon has to charge. Oh! Cool. Well, now we know. Alright, then. Next time. Had a little uh, freeze there, but that's okay. Flame Gale. I thought the meter was, like, for uses. Like, it was half charged, so I thought, oh, it's only gonna have one shot, and I can upgrade it to do two? I guess it has to fill all the way. Now we know. Hmm. Ouch! That's not nice. Savage Shadow Slash. Blue Medicine? Oh no! I should have checked the items. Oh. You thought full restores were bad? Get ready for Blue Medicine in this game. Hang on. Flip. He's got... He has six. He has six of those. Get him. Make him regret his decision. Savage Shadow Slash. Club Scissors. Why does the beaver have a rat tail? I have never noticed that in my, until now. You are correct. Maybe it's a translation thing? Maybe... Maybe Beaver Warrior was never a beaver to begin with. I feel like my whole life is a lie. Finish him. Finish him. Finish him. Finish him. That's right. Heal that. Okay, and now my fire dragon's a little, uh... Yeah, win. Let's see. Attacks can miss in this game, I'm pretty sure. Oh, boy. Well... Its attack is called Rodent Sword. Alright. I can always use Guard when I get- when things start to get a little dicey, but... Oh 
Oh, that's right. It is nighttime, so at least Zombie Warrior here gets a boost, I think. The Japanese name for Beaver Warrior is Luis. Oh, dear. He, ha he just had to get a critical hit there, didn't he? Oh, don't, 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 don't. Well, there goes the, there goes uh, the fire dragon. I can't really do anything about that. That critical hit just came out of nowhere. the advantage here. I might need to send Shimon back and bring Fizdis to uh, this place. Uh, I'm pretty sure I get it back at the end of the mission. I hope. That would be really, really bad. Like, really, really bad. Okay, I win. Oh! Blackland Fire Dragon still gets experience. That is... Thank you, game. Thank you. All right, let's... Yeah, let's do that. Yugi's approaching the forest. Oh boy. Safe is this more. Why? Shimon, Shimon is meant to, probably meant to be Simon. Oh, is it, is it like Shimon Belmondo? Perhaps. Alright. I'm gonna have to guard with Zombie Warrior. It's just in the graveyard. And as we all know, when something goes to the graveyard in Yu-Gi-Oh, it comes back immediately. Oh. I'm gonna guard. Will Fire Dragon still get experience? I wonder. Come on. Guard. Guardian Blade. I only had one monster reborn and I didn't put it on, uh... This team. Nice. Win. Alright, now Fire Dragon doesn't get anything. That's fair. F fair enough. I'm not sure if monsters have a speed stat. All right, you're taken care of. Let's let you send you back there. Um, Yugi need to go in the forest more. How about we do that? Is there any more enemy units? I don't see anything on the mini map. Logically, the next best thing would be to attack up here. What about over here? I can't check this guy's team before I go in to attack. We're being attacked by roaming monsters. Oh! That's a whole team! That's right, I can make a healer in the base. But, uh, just trying to... I think I got the medicine on this team. All right, um, let's take out Man Eater first. Don't attack me there. Man Eater's got four actions. Paralysis Scythe. Forty-two mince mixer. Give me a woo. Okay. 
Honey Honey is guarding. Paralysis Scythe. I hope that actually doesn't have paralysis. Pretty sure guard lasts for, um, until their next action. Hane Hane is scary in 3D. Yes, it is. Hack attack. Um, I guess I'll just keep attacking him. How does this work? Do I immediately attack, get into another skirmish? Alright, I'm gonna need you to stop attacking. Uh, Feral Imp here. That's just sitting right there. Okay, level up. What does leveling up my my duelist actually do? So, Mystic Horseman has joined your army. Oh, I got all of them. Man-eater bug. All right, that's cool. See, I never would have thought to just put my characters here to get that. <laughs> are you? All right. Good game. Good game. Good, good game. Two thousand three. <laughs> yeah, that deserves a clip, don't it? <laughs> Imagine planning out your strategy and going back to see that's happening. All right, I should make a healer. How about that? Equipment. No. Oh, eight hundred. Uh, this speeds up the recovery of life points and enables healing. Doubles the range of the anti. Okay, trade union prevents rising prices by making a trader always available. Enables the replenish command. I'm not sure what I want to go for. The myst mystical elf stuff is kind of, uh... Overpriced for a second mission. Let's see. I definitely want to go back and, uh, heal. Like... Are my life points recovering when I'm inside a fort? Like, can I see it? Not really sure. It's not going up. Hmm. I'm gonna have to just get it, aren't I? Can only check if you buy healing. Well, with how my team is currently right now, I'm gonna have to buy healing. Why not? Let's do it. First, let's get Yugi there. Because there's still quite a bit of enemies to take out. If I don't make use of that, it's not gonna... Mm. Come on, Yugi. Okay, healing. Oh, that's a lot. Their uh, health is getting bigger right now, but... Just do it. Alright, there we go. Yeah, it's going up right now. Just gonna do that. I'm just gonna go ahead and, and, and try not be stingy with the money. Okay, looks like Yugi's about ready to go. You're still going. Okay, team command. Let's have both Fizdis and Yugi go here.
Oh yeah, you said you were you were uh having surgery done before. I forgot about that, Akane. Have that go. It's been like what three days since my last stream. Three days of miserable things going wrong with editing. Yeah, but let's not go down with that. Let's just enjoy the Yu-Gi-Oh game. No, legit, I'm actually having fun with this. <laughs> Despite it, it, it's definitely a 2003 GameCube game. You can tell. You move pretty fast. This game has a lot of features it doesn't tell you about at all. Ah. All right, then. Oh, right, gotta check for items. All right, none. Um, let's just get rid of one monster at a time. It, see, it's pretty cool because I'm glad that I got those three monsters, but I never would have known about those if I if I didn't ask, right? But what can you do? Let's see, stone eyes. A part of me still wishes that they uh, Konami would make more like random Yu-Gi-Oh games like this back in the day. Like they had so many weird things. Like they even made like a kart racer on the Wii for um 5Ds. I, I a part of me wants to see them do some weird things with the license again. Goon string. Nowadays we're lucky enough to even get a card game sim from them, and even that's not perfect. Yes, there's a racing- there's a Yu-Gi-Oh! racing game on the Wii for 5Ds. Alright then. I know about Dungeon Dice Monsters. I'm not super enthusiastic about jumping into that, though. Maybe another time. Finish it. Finish it. Okay. Now we take out Stone Eyes. How about that? Uh, looks like we're having a little... A twitch issue there. Just suddenly dropped some frames. Looks like it's fine now, though. There was also Destiny Boar Traveler, but we don't talk about that game anymore. The Duel Monsters era undeniably had the most games, though. Let's see. Guard. Ah, oh, I hate when they do that. Inferno Trial. Laser Beam! Spin, Penguin, spin. I love that sound effect he makes when he does that. spins. Stone eyes. Millennium eye. Surprise horn- er. Okay, good, good, good. Getting some level ups, at least. The penguin- when the penguin spins, you win. Hang on. Let's let Yugi do this. Alright, you gotta move out of the way, because- Apparently, that's how it works. I don't see anyone else attacking. I'm assuming once I take this place here... Could very well. It's no longer nighttime, it seems. If I liberate more places, I'll get more money, and I won't have to feel bad about, uh... Buying all the healing. Okay. You're not fully recovered, Yugi. Well, Celtic Guard, but whatever. Wild Sonic Storm. Does it, does it bother anyone how sloppy that howl sound effect sounds? Like at the very end, it just it just seems like he's splashing him with water or something. Inferno Trial. Very, very echoey. 
Yeah, it is very echoey. Finish him. And now you decide to guard with that one. It will not help you, friend. They're both guarding now. Yeah. I oh, does the guard only last one attack? Oh. I thought it lasts until their next action. Well, all right then. Inferno Trial. Again! He's attacking again! That's right, you lose. Silver Fang leveled up. Feral Imp leveled up. Alright, cool. I'm gonna go ahead and just let Yugi do it again. I think I might be keeping Celtic Guardian for quite a while. Those three monsters seem like they'll be nice. I wish I had more people to, uh, to use, though. What ends the battle? When everyone runs out of action points. And whoever does the most damage. Obviously, it ends if I take out everything as well. Blue medicine received. There we go. Okay, now are they gonna attack me? Hang on a second. Master of Egyptian Gods. Night Adept. Water Adept. Can't seem to see. Oh, there's one guy there. Taking out as many people as possible seems like a good idea. Uh, our button zooms out. Okay, good. Team command. Fizdis is still recovering. Hmm. I got blue medicine, so I can afford some risk with Yugi. Nymph is recovering. What about you over here, friend? You seem to be good. How about we send you here? And we'll send Fizdis back here. Let's see. The time limit doesn't matter for 95% of maps. I've actually been told that this game has a glitch where um, if you linger on for, for too long on some maps, it crashes. And uh, supposedly this hap uh, people thought this is an emulator issue, but it apparently happens on real hardware as well. I don't know. It's been years though. If it's an emulator thing, it might have been fixed long by now. I'm leaving this empty, but I highly doubt any. Of, there's only one of each thing here, so they wouldn't attack. The real time limit, yes. Okay, you're there. Let's see if I can take this guy. I can always retreat if need be. Oh my! What did he have? I think he had Dark Rabbit there. It never happened to me on GameCube. Okay. That's good, then. Razzle Dazzle! Oh! That's gonna hurt. Ooh, that did hurt. Alright. His lead monster seems to be his ace. Or no, his weakest. What am I saying? Why did I say ace? That's completely wrong. Game crashes from just the map. Porygon. Oh, yeah. Oh, go oh, no. Not the good old Razzle Dazzle. I 
don't know. With RPGs like this, it's satisfying just to see your numbers go up. The rabbit does not fit with these monsters. No, it don't. Hey, qu uh, quick question, chat. I think Barrel Dragon is in this game. Um, does anyone know if they, if his model uses the censored uh, card art? Like, did they did they turn him into the Nerf Gun Dragon in this game? Is what I'm wondering, or did they not care enough? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna take out this thing next because Razzle Dazzle takes forever. Oh, did I miss? Oh, look, there's a miss. There you go. You've been proven wrong, chat member. It's uncensored? Okay. They didn't give it to... Alright, then. That's two misses in a row. He heard I didn't like the razzle-dazzle, and then he got a crit on me. That's mean. I wonder what the critical hits are. It's funny, because there's actually a Toon Barrel Dragon... Oh, I, oh he, wow, he destroyed me. But I still got experience. It is the censored one? Well, I don't, well, we seem to disagree here, but um, for those that don't know, Barrel Dragon, who is Bandit Keith's mon ace monster, it's like a dragon that has, like, two giant, like, long gun barrels on its head and its arms, and, uh, in the, you, in the, anime in the card, they, uh, they turned it into, like, these br bright, like, orange and green colors to make it look like a nerf gun. And, hang on, what are you doing? Hmm. Yugi, have you liberated here yet? And they actually made a Toon version of the card ca called Toon Barrel Dragon. And that version just, the Japanese art, art just uses the, the western nerf gun version just as a joke it's pretty hilarious i like that i like when so i like when um some cards actually make fun of some of the changes that the old north american stuff had to do let's see boop, boop, boop. let's see also yeah you want stuff that doesn't fit how about this floating teddy bear hang on Let's see. Actually, now would be a good time to use blue medicine. It's a dinosaur. Monster Reborn Reborn is another funny joke. The art shows the Japanese version of Monster Reborn just standing above all these discarded ver versions of the, the old western one. Harry Brain's late slash. Tiger grasp. Ow. Can you get the dinosaur? I don't know, actually. I'm gonna need to win this fight. Don't hurt the teddy? That teddy looks like it's gonna hurt me. Another sloppy attack. Do new Yu-Gi-Oh Yu cards still get censored? I honestly don't know. I mean, I think some part of them still tries to uh, market market them towards a younger audience for some reason, but for the most part, I think they're well aware that it's just young adults that play Yu-Gi-Oh now. Yes, uh, the Scissor Fluffle one did. They took scissors out of its card art. Okay, then. Alright, then. Well, I'm not gonna talk about things I don't know. Celtic Guardian, nice. My ace monster's leveling up. Age is six and up. Remember, you can't... You can't play Yu-Gi-Oh! unless your age is six and up. Now, before we do that... Uh, let's go here again. Oops. The dinosaur is still there, don't worry.
wait. Spinning dynamite punch. Okay, I don't have medicine on this team, but that's fine. Oh. Does anyone want to explain to me why everything is missing this stupid thing? Hmm. the lucky ability. There we go. Now we don't gotta worry about that one anymore. Okay, my team should be good. I can take this guy out. Can you imagine if I didn't get rid of, like, Karibo and whatever the other thing was on this team? Shadow Spectre, I think? Yeah. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. That's good. What is this game about? You're a Yu-Gi-Oh! You're Yugi. You're Yugi Yu-Gi-Oh! And you are in a virtual world and must save Virtual Kingdom with dual monsters because the entire world revolves around it. I always kept Karibo. Well, you played wrong, person who's played this game since childhood. I'm on the internet, and I'm making that bold statement. There we go. The rabbit's been cooked. Yeah, who saw that win coming? Nice. Legendary sword received. Well, all right then. Now then. Let's finish this guy off, and then let's regroup so we can destroy this guy. I didn't end up needing that catapult turtle at all. Wild bite. Tiger Grasp. Hmm. Maybe next Feral Imp turn I could use... another medicine. Ooh. I can't tell if he's howling at the opponent or spitting. Maybe it's like is his breath or something. It's just like got, got that much much moisture there. Weird to think about. Chat. My I... oh, that's the windmill in the corner. I was confused what that was for a second. You can keep Karibo, multiply and items broke break him. Ah. Oh, now you're guarding, huh? Not gonna help you. Yeah, just enough. Oops. Dinosaur. Destroy. Wild bite. Oh, dear. Lose! At least everyone levels up. There's a- the stars are the amount of actions you have left. Alright, finish it off, finish it off. Then I'll send everyone back to heal center. And- oh wait, no, there's two enemy strongholds left? What's going on there? Why are you beating up Dinosaur for the experience? Use it on. I'm care being careful not to hit the wrong button. They're supposed to be extinct. Yes, that's why.
Wild Sonic Storm. left do I really want to risk I don't think I want to risk losing losing Celtic guard at this point wild bite okay here we go finish him HP there. All right. Good, good, good. 800 gold received. Okay. Now. Wait. This is the right one, isn't it? Oh, what am I doing? I'm in the wrong one. Silly, silly me over here. Is he gonna accidentally enter that? I hope he doesn't. Uh, uh. Enter the fort. And, hang on, where's business? Is he already in the fort? I think he is. Yes, he is. Still healing. We'll strike at dawn. Do you keep getting gold at the end of the level? I'm assuming so. Again, I haven't played this game since I was really, really young when it first came out. Okay. What's gonna happen? What are y'all talking about? The crash? I hope not. This game is weird? Yes, it is. But... The best kind of games are the weird spin-offs that literally nobody asked for. And then we spend forever demanding sequels and never get them. Hmm. The enemy's not attacking me because there's literally one left. And the boss. The boss isn't going to leave his spot, so I don't have to worry about that. Let's see. Commands. I play this on GameCube as a kid and never knew how to play it, so I just abandoned it. I can see how people would get confused with this game. Uh, Celtic Guard is uh, taking his sweet time getting here, ain't he? Yeah, this definitely does seem like the kind of game people would rent rather than buy. Uh, get there. Okay. Hmm. Healing. Okay, you're good to go. So, I'm gonna get... Fizdis. No, not heal. Not heal. Nope. Team Command, Fizdis. Let's get you into position. I don't think we'd ever get an HD port, but yeah, a GameCube, uh, a GameCube Virtual Console version would be pretty cool too, but I don't know. The fact that, like, even though Konami makes the trading card game and they have the video game license, it's not, it, it's not exactly as simple to just re-release it on Virtual Console as a lot of other games or a lot of other IPs. It might, I, I think... Anime licensed games really don't really get re-released all that much, do they? At least nowadays, it's easier for people to get their hands on this stuff. A little further, a little further for you. I don't want to have to spend money if I don't have to. Maybe two units would be good enough to deal with him. 
can barely see that. Can barely see him in the grass there. Look at that. Barrel Dragon actually does have its uh, nerf gun colors. I gotta see that. I gotta see that. By the way, I've recently learned that there's like Barrel Dragon support cards, and they look kind of fun. I kind of want to try and make a Barrel Dragon deck. Especially since they have that like other boss monster, like Desperado Barrel Dragon. And there's like a continuous trap that makes it so that uh, you can like, you can banish it from your graveyard to change the results of the coin flips, or get additional effects based on the amount of heads. Okay, let's move you now. I don't think I'm gonna need a uh, Yugi going here now, huh? Hang on a second. Like, it's getting there, it's fine. I just don't want to give him time to heal, so I want to have make sure everyone's in position here. It definitely seems like this might be a bit of a slow game, but whatever. I think they're just called the Gun Dragon cards. A little closer. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to spend that much. Watch me have, like, more than enough money by the end of the game. I think I wasn't very good at this when I played it, first played it back in the day, but to be fair, I had no idea what I was doing, so I probably just was not making use of, like, all the monsters and, and stuff properly. Okay. The time limit is running out. Yeah, you're good enough. You're good enough. No, I don't want to pay 80. Hmm. There you go. Pay that. Okay, I'm probably not even going to need him now. Get him. Take him down. You've done well for a bunch of misfit rebels. It's been a long time since an enemy got me this excited. Is that like an alligator helmet? That looks so weird. But playtime is over. It won't be long before you beg Sebekel for mercy. What's he got? Alright. Um... Looks like Mountain Warrior is the one I want to deal with first. Oh, wait. Items. Legendary Sword. Um, only Warrior Monsters can wield. Boost attack by 500 points. Oh! Maybe I should... Oh, did I accidentally hit wait? I think I did. Oops. Maybe I should focus on the one in the middle. Because he is way too strong for right now, ain't he? Uh-oh. Yeah, here we go. This is... Okay, it's a good thing I have all three people coming, coming here now. Don't attack the penguin. Assault. Don't do that, man. It did a lot of damage, yeah. I think I need to get I need to get rid of that one in the middle. They don't have healing items, but they have heh. Even if I lose monsters this one, um I have two other teams here, it's fine. Hmm. Oh, that's gonna do a lot. Oh, 288. Penguin spin. Okay, okay. Penguin spin again. 
Gonna send in Shimon next. Shimon, Simon, Shimon Del Mondo. Don't hurt the penguin. At least the penguin has has surprisingly good defense. Yeah, this is the boss. Let's see. Eighty-one. Just keep attacking. Maybe it'll help. Yeah, of course he won. Why wouldn't he have won that? He did so much. Alright. Wait there. Let's do it. He's almost down. Oh, of course he guards. Alright, in that case, I'll attack this one for the time being. Gotta whittle it down. I don't want to waste any attacks. He only has one more attack on him. Claw. Does this guard off now? Who does it? Yeah, I just wanted to hit him in there anyway. Yeah, he's guarding again. You're guarding. Everybody's gonna guard. But that's not gonna help him. Well. I made his HP so low that he's too scared to attack me now, so it's fine. Lose. He still beat me. Whatever, I got experience. Time wizard. Where's Yugi at? Not there. Not even close to being there. I can definitely finish him. Let's see now. Crushing Axe, oh here it comes. Ooh. I like how these fields are like, have a sandstorm going on for some reason. Breathe fly on it. Ah, oh, come on, one more. I got a legendary sword as well, but, um... How does this game work? Like, uh... Is there still, like, a, a difference between Warrior and Beast Warrior? Like, can I not give Beaver Warrior the Legendary Sword after ba after the battle? I hope I can. I mean, um, I'm pretty sure that Zombie Warrior here is also a zombie and not a warrior. I guess we'll have to find out. I could just give it to Celtic Guardian, I suppose. That'd probably be the best option. Especially since I'm planning on sticking. Oh, really? He's still there. I guess Fizdus is gonna have to finish it. Finish him, Penguin. Penguin spin attack. Yeah. Win. Nice. Bounce, 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 bounce. It's like the DVD thing. Ashton was liberated. Oh, you'll pay for that. I was going to let you live, but not now. I'm sure you were. 
Yugi. Yugi, it's you. Oh, Tristan, what are you doing here? Trapped in the game, just like you, I guess. Joe and the others are here too. I was just with them a little while ago. Kaiba is working for the Empire. After losing to him, we felt it was safer to split up. Kaiba? Yep, not sure why he's here, but he is. Anyway, came to the island to organize my own resistance army. I should have known that you'd be leading the resistance. It's the role I was given. Where's everyone else? I don't know. We all separated and went underground to gather followers for the resistance. My guess is that they're still on the mainland trying to gather support and form new units. If we keep fighting against the Empire, we're sure to run into them again. Good point. I don't think we have any other options anyway. Since I'm already here, I'm yours to command, Mr. Resistance Leader. At ease, soldier. It's good to have a familiar face on my team. Excellent. So I got Tristan. That's should be three more monsters, right? Strategy. With the southernmost or, or with the southern farms freed, the resistance army now controls the western half of Vaxi Island. But Cap Capulia, ruler ruler of Sugat, has reestablished order in the island capital and plans to subdue the resistance. He has put his trusted marshal Granus in charge of her large force and dispatched them to the west. Granus' armory is moving steadily west along Central Way, heading straight for Makad. The Empire has finally dispatched a large unit to hunt us down. The Resistance will suffer severe casualties if we try to fight them head on. Do you have any suggestions, Simon? Hmm, the Imperial forces don't consider us a serious threat yet, and are not being as cautious as they should. Therein lies the opportunity. What do you mean? There is a fort along Central Way, and the enemy plans to move its main force there on the way to Sugat. The forest, fort is completely empty right now. We might be able to spring a trap on them there. Interesting. We can attack them with fire. Exactly. I'll get started on the preparations immediately. Okay. Giant Soldier of Stone, Gazelle, and... Swordsman from a foreign land who has such a pitiful amount of attack, it's not even funny. Let's see, who can we put on instead? Mystic Horseman. That's good at stats, but. Mm. Man Eater Bug for the memes. Hane Hane is there too. Shadow Spectre is garbage. Hmm. Can go all the way top. I'll give him Maneater for now. Which, uh, yeah, Soldier seems pretty good. Uh, give me the mark. It costs money to bring them into battle, it seems. And let's replace this thing, because it's not good. Maybe I should put the, put the horseman here. Wait. Oh, do I have to do it like this? I guess I do, huh? Horseman needs to be the center, so he'll move faster, I think. He's got decent stats. I don't want to see that. I want to see their abilities. Constructor. Can I read what that ability does, please? <sighs> Won't let me. It just keeps going to the item menu now. I don't know. I don't understand this menu. It's so unintuitive. Untu yeah, unintuitive. It would be it would be helpful if I could just read his ability, but I can't. I can't even read the monster abilities anymore, which is annoying. For some reason, it just has items now. I think you have to select the ability menu and the. The menu. Hmm. 
Are you kidding me? So, in order to check... In order to check this... Hang on a second. Can I... Okay, there we go. Now it's working. I press... I tried pressing that button before. And it didn't do anything. Oh, that... That makes me upset. It would help if the all the button options were on screen instead of just half of them. Oh, that's dumb. Grapple Talon. Okay, now it's working. Whatever. Ability. Field Adept. Priest when in fields. I can do that. Whatever. Alright, so I think that's a good... I think that's a good way to mix it up right now. Let's just do it. It should be fine. I want to do the next mission. We're nearing two hours. I think I can do another mission. This fort here is the key to our current plan. We've rigged the fire to go off at nine tonight. Any teams in the fort when the fire starts will suffer heavy damage. We also received news that the enemy is headed straight along the central way towards this fort. We will avoid direct confrontation, lure the enemy to the fort, and then crush them after the fire. You can get Wing Dragon Guardian of the Fortress by sending Yugi to the mountains. Alright, good. We will need to defend the fort until the prearranged time and keep the enemy from advancing too far. Yugi's forces free. Tele knows. <laughs> Tele knows. Yortsen falls to the enemy. So I need to just stop. I need to just keep battling them to keep them away. Oh, they're they're really. Yeah, I need to make sure they stay in there. How about we move you there too? The mountains is Yugi. Only Yugi. Go Yugi. Die throw is taken by the enemy. Why is there a lot of them? There's a lot of them. I'm kind of confused. Am I supposed to attack them, or do I just leave them alone? Like, I... Uh... I don't want to make a mistake here. Yeah, let's, uh, stand here and wait. Because it said... you need. It said I needed to stop them, but... Hang on, there's a fort down here. Wait, what did that say? Oh, I'm not reading the name of that one out loud. Oh, dear. Come on, Yugi. I'm just gonna stand outside this fort right here. Yeah, I think if I try and take that fort over here, they'll just, um, try and go, uh... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Someone on the localization team didn't think that one through. Also, where's the dragon? Come on. Do I have to go all the way over here? Yeah, somebody was just, um, didn't think it through when they went on fantasynamegenerator.net. <laughs> just wait till 9 o'clock. Hey, uh, why are they standing outside just waiting? 
You think maybe they set a trap for us? No, no, everybody stay in the fort. Everybody stay in the fort. Everybody stay in the fort. Just don't worry about it. I want a winged dragon guardian of the fortress number one. But I don't see a winged dragon guardian of the fortress number one. Teams are going to be real weak once they, um... Hmm. What is this exactly? Like a village, or... I guess it's supposed to be a village, and this is supposed to be a little church. Directly, it's... I think it's directly middle of the... Of the fort in the mountain. Hang on. Right around here, I suppose. Yeah, see, I'd never know this. I would never absolutely know this. Hang on. Yeah, it's about here. Hmm. Nice, wholesome, relaxing music. It's not 9 o'clock yet. It's well stocked with supplies. Oh, it will be. Let's see... I think it's... Oh, no, you think it's north of this castle? I guess we'll find out in a moment. It's almost time! There we go. It's fire. Teams in the fort are taking heavy damage. Now's our chance to strike. However, first, let's... Let's just move you over here. And let's start battling. Get him, Tristan. You can do it. Oh, wow, they're... Yeah, they're done. Oh, hello, Thunder Dragon. This is... This was before Thunder Dragon became a star. Think you can stop me? You can't stop anything. Oh. And I can't stop you either. Because my monsters are dumb. Probably should have put some medicine on the teams. I forgot to do that. Nice. Everyone gets a level up. I'll take that. So all these teams are just here for the Taken now. He's got generic normal monsters. That's a thing with a big scythe. Grapple Talon. I can't do that. It's my ability. Hunting Slice. Ow. Okay. You're the weakest penguin, so let's take out the weakest monster. Spinning Penguin Attack. Critical. Nice. Finish him. Did I miss? Oh, give me a break. Come on. They're literally they literally are left with one hit and I'm and stuff like this is happening. Oops, I hit the wrong button there. Nice. 
Look at me, I win. Nice. Mystic Horseman seems like a good... Oh, I forgot to put the Legendary Sword on. Oh. I'm surprised there's not like a, bu a bunch of people who are yelling at me over that. Oh, look, it's Phantom Dewan. I remember him from Reshef. And what is that? One of those generic lizard warrior things. Okay, this one has 55 HP. Don't mess this up, man, your bug. Prove you're worth it. Yeah! The penguin waits. As soon as someone says the penguin looks cute, I just destroyed it. Nice. I don't think that's Gogo -go Gaga Gigo. This is some free experience right here. Definitely good for a character like Tristan that I just got, along with these new monsters. How many's left? Two. Hey, Cyber Commander! Why does he have that and Tristan didn't? Robotic Knight. Makes about as much sense as anything in this game. Let's see. Go, Penguin, go. 88. Overdrive spray. Yeah, just do that. Win. Everybody's getting level ups now. One more. Let me take the fort. Oh, he's got Shadow Ghoul? Okay, let's finish him. Uh, hopefully you can do this, Maneater. Come on, Maneater. You used to be cool. Split Maze. Guard. Oh, that won't help you. When am I playing more Baby Farm game? Not sure. Maybe next stream. For now, I just wanted to stream today and have fun. And relax. With Yu-Gi-Oh! and Paper Mario. Oh, he's gonna be like this. Not even sure if I'm gonna be streaming tomorrow. I mean, what am I gonna do? Just wait here. Hey, are you joking? You really want to look at that and tell me that that was his win? Get out of here. Get out of here with that crap. Garbage. Trash video game. Live this. Yeah, the hand should be middle finger now. Excellent. Boop, 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 boop. Excellent. And now we wait to see if Yugi can find that dragon. Checkpoint. I need to take those guys out. Uh, we still haven't found it. Just keep looking. Oh, 
We'll get there one day. We'll get there one day. You know what I should do? How about I move someone to that fort now so I can, um... Get some extra money from it. Hang on. Still haven't found it. Oh my goodness. I feel like I'm being bamboozled at this point. Come on. Is it this spot? Maybe? Just wait around. Yeah, see, this game gives me, like, Digimon World 1 vibes in that it's an old RPG that I just have to... I just have to go back to and maybe beat. There we go. Uh-oh. Now they're attacking. Uh, I think I'll be fine. Too late to set up equipment now. I'll just have to deal with it. Get him here, and then I'll start moving side to side through the mountain in a moment. Don't worry. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Let's see. Oh, it's literally the same guy, but full health now, huh? Huh. No items. Oh, ah, I hit wait. That's a really annoyance, annoying thing. Let's get rid of Rocket Warrior then. People don't even seem to- people in the chat don't seem to know when their monster is, either. Some are saying it's north of the castle, some are saying it's north of the, of the city in the middle. I'm just gonna have to walk all around the mountain and find it. Yeah, it looks like I'm losing Gazelle. That's fine. Ooh, sword. Got destroyed. Finish it. Finish it. Oh, good. Critical. said it wasn't the mountain now. I don't even know what people are going on about. It's the northwest west section of the mountains? Oh, and here I was on the complete other side. Win. Get back now, friend. At least Gazelle got his level up before he went away. East? I thought you said weast. Which one just guarded? I think it was the middle. Rip. 
ripping apart. Paralysis Scythe. Video says it's more towards the base of the mountain, just to the left of the middle fort. How are people supposed to find this? <laughs> Paralysis Scythe. Tristan's not gonna last against this guy. Randomly. And it only appears if you're Yugi. Not even a su suspicious looking part, it just popped up as he walked up the mountain. Great. Alright then. Well, I'm not gonna have time to adjust Yugi's uh, path here, because this. Yeah, he's gonna come right back. Oh boy. I'm just pretty much using up a giant soldier here, and then Simon's gonna show up and finish him. I got my experience for the day, it's fine. Finish me off already! Did it, friend. Very meager amounts of experience, but it's better than nothing. More tank by the enemy. Should be going around there then. Got him. It's night time. I'll get a bit of a boost, I hope. And then take him out. It'd be nice if I could just, if this guy could just go away so I can just get that dragon. That's all I want. But no, I have to miss. Dragon's probably not even that not even that good either. Forty-three, paralysis scythe. Finish him already. Finish him. Critical. Oh, you're gonna play the guard game now, huh? And I missed. Pretty cool. All right. Six, eight, seven. Excellent. Liberated. All right, Yugi, you're gonna get that. You're gonna go get it, and you are gonna stop fooling around. Oh, come on, Yugi. Maybe I can make the dragon uh the center monster, and he'll move a bit faster. That sounds like a good idea. Keep going, keep going. It's 
closer to the base of the mountain, as I've been told. We're gonna have to inch along here. Yeah. Is it a raid? Yeah, yeah. Hmm, seems tame enough. Do you want to come with me? Nods. Wang Dragon, Guardian of the Fortress Number One, has joined your army. How would anyone find that? They wouldn't. They wouldn't. <laughs> okay, then. I'm gonna need both Fizdis and uh, Yugi here to take out the boss. Nods. Yeah. Quality cutscene. Yugi's at full health, by the way, so let's just get him near this. It's the last one we have to deal with. Oh boy. Imagine doing this without a guide and just having you- What? What are you doing? What, what, what are you doing? Where, where did this come from? What? No, I just- what? 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 What's going on here? What? Why are they respawning? Run! What? 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 What, what is this? Enemies respawn after five in-game minutes. So this is why nobody likes this game. Well, I hope I hope the dragon was worth it. Imagine trying to, to comb every inch of the map with this. With this mechanic existing, huh? Allies will respawn too. This is dumb. I don't recall this. Heat wave. Well then. Heat wave. Invisible time limit. Simon's gonna take out as many as he can. Yugi's just gonna have to get in there and take out the boss now. If only I'd remembered to put the legendary sword on. That would have helped. I missed. I really regret not fortifying this place now. Well, lesson learned. Now I know to do that ne next time. No, you get in, the, get in there. You've done it now, Rebels. I'm going to finish every last one of you. Here he comes. Gonna have to take this guy out and I win. Okay. Uh, might be a little tricky. Let's see. Oh, they- two of them have healing items! That's so cool! That's so, so cool. You didn't equip the dragon? Son, have you not been paying attention the last two hours? I don't think you know how this game works. Okay. 
Okay, its defenses are down. Shredder. None of them use blue medicine, please. Oh, you're using it. How much to heal? 369, huh? You only got two actions left. Oh, you piece of crap. Oh, I hate this game. I hate it so much. How the heck do I deal with this? Probably by putting on that sword, but I can't. Oh, man. And just like that, nothing happened. Does wait not use up uh, an action point? That sounds like it'd be useful. I might be in trouble. I very well might have just lost this. Oh, cool, I missed. I wish I could just adjust the equipment right now, but I don't have time. Well, at least there's leveling up happening. Ah! I'm gonna need to get Fizdis here to just intercept and take them out. I can do this. Maybe. You think this is gonna stop me? No, this is just gonna give me extra experience points. Ah, uh, I see. Rodent sword. I'm not sure if the enemies have missed me yet. It would sure be nice if they did. Yeah, getting Tristan back will be good. I assume he'll respawn at the main base back there. That's right, there's a miss. I'll take it. X. Simon is actually really holding his own right here. The enemies only get half health, but still. I just took them all out. Look at that. And I get stronger. Even stronger. I can heal, but the enemies keep our... The enemies still move towards me while I'm in the menu, so I can't really set that up. Uh... Dang it. I forgot he was still moving. No problem. Maybe I should just be waiting. If I just wait until they use up all their attacks, 
Maybe I could just strike at all at one all at once against one of them. Hmm. I'm gonna try this. It might be risky. Oh, that did. Uh, that was critical. Cool. Okay then. You want to play the medicine game? Fine, I'll play the medicine game. Silver Fang. Wait, do those... Do they replenish all the way to seven at the end of the battle? I think they do. Yeah, whatever. Okay. Wait. I'll use a single guard. Okay. Alright. Now let's take him out. Hopefully I have enough. Uh, get rid of one of them at least. Really regret not putting that sword on at the start. There we go. I got one more attack, so let's just get start attacking you now. I lost, but that's okay. Leveling up is good. It's always good, right? Dang it! I was so close. Well, at least this is Fizdis and not, uh, Simon. Extra experience, everybody. Extra experience. Let's see. Let's get, rock get rid of Rocket Warrior. Finish it. Finish it, Penguin. Critical. Guard. Well, I guess I know what my next action is. Go, Penguin, go! 93. Paralysis Scythe. This team's not in danger at all. Maybe horn imp a little bit, but eh. Oh, nice. Critical hit time, I will win. 94. I'm gonna take out what's in the wasteland here. There we go. Just give him a finger right there. Looks like that's a lot of experience. I'm, I'm guessing the experience is based on the amount of damage you do, those points. All right. Another Simon Bill fight. Excellent. All right. Robotic Knight again, Mince Mixer. Uh-oh. A crit. Oh, he's got... Look at that! He's got a little, uh... He's got a Nerf gun arm. Of course he does. Okay. May as well get rid of the small fry. I'm 
guard. They're both guarding, huh? I couldn't tell what that second guard was. Yeah, zero. Doesn't matter what I do. Oh, I missed! Doesn't matter what I do. And we'll take you out next, too. He's also got a... Him. Oh, that's a pretty good hit. A little extra experience to squeeze in. Oh, Fire Dragon didn't get anything this time because he didn't do damage. I think it's literally they get the experience they get is the da is based on the damage the individual monster does. Oh, oh, they're just getting knocked into each other there. Cool. Do I get an advantage when I attack them in like the dazed state? I must. I have to. Did I miss? Okay, no, I hit it. Looked over and didn't see him moving. Oh, no. Horn Imp got experience, so I don't know. I don't know how the EXP formula is in this game. Everybody's just getting moved around now. Alright, this guy again. Let's take out Phantom Dewan. This should finish him. Spinning Sword Slash. DD3. Penguin time. Crushing Axe. Horn Imp's gonna probably go down, but that's okay. I'm surprisingly dealing with these guys okay. I was really scared when they all started uh, spawning again. Alright, there goes Horn Imp. Penguin's fine. My penguin's better than your penguin. Okay. Hope this is a critical. Good enough. Can two penguin attacks finish it off? Penguin Soldier got two level ups off that. Pretty good, pretty good. Alright. Is that all of them? Excellent. Everybody, get him. So I ended up buying a, a healing thing, but it ended up being completely worthless. I couldn't even use it because of all the... I had, like, no time. <laughs> it's just a waste of money. I'm, I'm not gonna spend anything to heal now. Oh, boy. But, let's heal up Celtic Guardian. We're gonna wait for him to use up his actions again. You think you, you, think you, you, you scare me, friend? You think you scare me? Precision Slash. I just need him to use up his thing. Okay, um... How about yourself there, friend? You can do this. Wait. Wait. Attack and Silver Fang. He's got one action left. It's fine. Heal up Silver Fang. Ooh, 
Wait. Wait. No, you move first, pal. No, you! Guard. Um, now the question is... He guarded now, so... Uh... So, do we have confirmation on how gra a guard works? Like, does it last a certain amount of turns, or... Is it literally just like the... Like... The rest of the battle now, because it was it was his last action. I think I'll just take out the swordswoman then. How about that? I don't want to waste turns after that. Slash. Six. Should definitely be enough. The waiting game. Oh, guard works until they at least take one damage. That explains how it. What I was seeing before, how I was dealing zero and the guard still lasted. That makes sense. Okay, good enough. Let's finish him off. Is all I gotta do now. Don't respawn, don't respawn. I'm assuming Tristan, yeah, respawns at the the starting base I was at. Okay. Well, I doubt he's gonna use medicine right away, so let's just do this first. Shredder. Wait. Wait. One more action, pal. Be it might be even more annoying if he uses guard, though. Oh, I got a crit. Now he's definitely gonna use it. So I may as well just go all in and attack him. What a time for that to happen. <sighs> he's got 14 left. <laughs> Doesn't matter, he's got no actions now. Let's deal the damage. Think of how much faster this could have been if I just put the sword on that I remembered. There we go. Let's see. Pretty good, pretty good. 800 G's from Tela Nose. 1189, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Battle for Sugit. Like a candy bar. After the great victory on the Central Way, the only enemy forces left are those of Kapulia and Sugit. Realizing that he is at a disadvantage, he has fortified the defenses at the castle and hold up there. Yugi's forces are having difficulty breaking the defenses. Will they be able to take Sugit and free the island? Alright. Tristan has to be on here. Business is just completely ignorable. So, okay, we've been going quite a while. This is probably a good point to stop. Because I don't know how long a mission will take. Saving. Save successful. Alright. And so this was the beginning of Yu-Gi-Oh! False Bound Kingdom. 
Um, I definitely say it's been a lot of fun so far. And we're gonna go ahead and resume it maybe next time. I, I think I want to keep going going um this is a long game and I knew that going into it but I really want I've really been waiting years to just kind of get back to this and beat it once and for all and I, I think getting the extra monsters is gonna help it's gonna be fun sword can go on next time but we're gonna finish Paper Mario now um YouTube audience hope you all enjoyed and uh, have a good night bye bye <laughs>